And uh, what I'm going to be doing now will be connecting the Xiaomi um, Wi-Fi Extender 2 to the Tello and in turn connecting the extender to the actual uh, phone. This is an Android phone. So it should, in theory, be able to operate the Tello. So the signal goes from here to the Wi-Fi Extender to the actual phone and backwards so that should uh, hopefully work it's a, a pretty simple process of getting this thing to work we'll fire it up by simply plugging in the Wi-Fi extender itself there's a little plug on the back here you'll notice there's a little tiny hole that's a reset button in case you make a mistake don't panic it's uh, not a big deal you've got this little yellow light flashing in here that's to tell you that there's power running through so we'll put that in there we need to also turn on the tallow of course which I'll do right now so you can see it's flickering away so we'll put that there next thing we need to do is put an app on the phone but I've already got the app installed so just to save a bit of time click on your Play Store you go to Xiaomi um, now you take the my home which is that one on the top there as I said I've already got it installed I've also got all my um, uh, you know passwords and security number everything's already been set in there so that's all all the stuff you need to do there under your settings um, now the simplest way to actually do this is just simply click add device you've got um, if you want to do it under this one you can go under household security and there's the repeater itself or you can just simply go to devices nearby you can see the little red button there it's already found it so it's already found the uh, Wi-Fi so let's click on the repeater we need to connect to another router because we don't want to use my home router you'll notice here it's got the tello no password already in there so if we tap on that it's telling it's unsecured doesn't have any encryption do I want to use it the answer is yes and we click next now what it's doing now is pairing the tello to the Wi-Fi connector to the extender so it's doing all the job for you you don't have to worry about all that other stuff that I've seen other videos doing which is a pain in the tail this is so much easier uh, I'll just let this go through once the signal is complete we should get a message telling me that there's an error totally ignore it because there is not an error so we'll let that go through and I'll come back in a second or two as you can see here connecting to network timed out so it's telling us it didn't work but it did work so totally ignore all that don't have to panic at all we just simply shut that down we'll cancel it at this point oh, actually I should say okay forget it it's done don't have to worry shut this thing off get rid of it get rid of that the Wi-Fi has successfully connected even though you don't believe it at this point it has now what we're going to do is connect the quadcopter um, we use a telepilot changing it from the standard and we're going to plus so we are now connected into there and fire up in here and tap it and there we go so we are now connected through from the mobile phone um, to the extender to the actual tello itself so that's how easy it is it's um, it's so simple uh, with this new system that they've got in their app um, there's no reason why you shouldn't do it yourself one thing I nearly forgot <laughs> if you look on the back here see the light has turned blue that tells you that you have now connected successfully you've paired the two together so it's working nicely I've got the controller here as you can see it's all working and uh, it's just a matter of getting it to fly now I'm a bit too close to the camera otherwise I'll take it up right now now that I've got everything connected correctly um, that's via electronically I should say it's a lot easier the process now you simply turn on your tello let it rattle away plug in the Wi-Fi extender which I'm doing now turn on the phone load up your app turn the app on allow it to do its uh, its magic and of 
for some of it. There it goes. Done. So that's all you've got to do, uh, and you've got the extender working. So thanks for watching. Greatly appreciated if you subscribe. If you're not, eh, leave a comment below, and I'll still be happy anyway. All the best. Catch you later.